<sighs> Damn, Q. Maybe you did that. Yo, 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 you already know what it is, man. Everybody loves BBW. That's Beards, Bourbon, Whiskey, the podcast. Whole gang is back in the building, man. Got my man Angry Principal off camera. What's up? Got my man Bo holding it down. I say. And of course, man, it's your boy Q Lewis holding it down live from the 48205, man. Red Zone, baby, you already know what it is. All right, so we uh, we going back to uh, Dragon's Milk. If you remember, like, maybe uh, two years ago, we did a Dragon Milk uh, expression. Uh, this one is Beer Barrel Bourbon. So, of course, because Angry Principal loves dragon milk. <laughs> hey, look, I love the beer. I love the liquor. The liquor. And this is the beer barrel, uh, beer, beer barrel, barrel bourbon. Say that fast. From New times. Holland Distillery out in Holland, Michigan. One of the nicer tasting rooms that you can go to. So, if you're ever out in Holland, Michigan... That's the spot to see. Yeah. <laughs> which, which, if you're colored, which, you're probably yeah, not. Yeah. Hey, I look, when I was in there, I was the only, yeah. we were only black people there. There's a I'm bunch sure. of tulips and wooden shoes out right. there. I mean, for real. Man, that tulip thing is about as big as my backyard. <laughs> not, all that, those pictures you see, is yeah. not. This is it's one not little, even. It's little square footage. Yeah, that's all it is. That's a tourist trap. That's all tulips is. and square. <laughs> Fucking wooden shoes. <laughs> shoes, the claw. But oh, the reason God. I picked this up is because it is... Uh, 112 proof. Okay. Mm. So anything over 100, I'm, especially from them, I'm going to try to try see what it is. Hit up and see what it's like. So been mm -hmm. holding on to this one for a minute. I want it's a single barrel. Oh shit. So each barrel is going to taste a little different every yeah. time. I already took. Already. Oh okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, my bad. My bad. <laughs> All right, so let's get to that cork then. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm over here fucking up. But, beer, uh, beer. Like Dragon's Milk, the beer. If you like a darker beer, mm -hmm. uh, then you're gonna love it. Okay. Mm -hmm. If you don't like that dark stout, you're not gonna like yeah, it. Yeah, so. not so much. But I do like the liquor. Right, and I do right. like this. So no, nah, like Guinness and all that. Yeah, yeah, fucking yeah. nah, I can't no, fuck yeah, that shit. Yeah. I, I, I rather really really just I rather really just drink liquor. Or like Hawker Shore. Yeah, yeah. It's nah, German. Yeah, yeah. It's German. Yeah. Yeah. So, dog, yeah. I was gonna say dog probably had it. So that's you what we tried. The beer barrel. They they ferment. They they put it in the beer barrels that they ferment everything that they do. Okay. For their beer, then they put the liquor in there and try to infuse that taste in it. So I think it's kind of fun, and mm -hmm. let's, That's see, be let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. Yeah. Pause for the cork. Oh, okay, shit. Sure. Yeah. All right, beer barrel. <laughs> this beer is barrel bourbon. This is about to be interesting, though, yeah. because yeah, those like real dark, robust motherfucking uh, beers and ales and shit. Old just, world style. Yeah, I'm straight. Man. <laughs> Man, a lot of oak on oh, this one. Yeah. A lot of oak on right this one. Right off the rip. Wow. Boy. Yeah, oaky. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Oaky. No, like somebody just built a motherfucking cabin. <laughs> 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 like Granddaddy just finished the cabin, baby. Dog, that's wild as hell. Yo, you know what it is? Like when you buy brand new uh, like office furniture and you open the box. That's what this is like. Yeah, this is good. That's Stop your fire. Playing. And it's got the beer taste to it. So it's got that dragon milk taste to it. <laughs> Along with this. Oh, this is Let me see. Let me see. Good, it up. It's got a little sweetness. Yeah. Too. A little maple, maybe. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> you don't like it, do you? You don't like that? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Nah. It tastes like beer. It tastes it's got like a beer fucking taste. beer. It's got a, it's got a beer hit to it. It's yeah. got a Pepsi taste to it in there. A okay. cola taste in there also. <laughs> Yo, this is... I'm gonna tell you why this is fucked up though. Because it's a hundred and fucking what's twelve? Yeah. 113. You can't smooth. You can't drink shit like this at 113. Somebody's going to die. Yeah. This yeah. is really, really good. <laughs> this shit is straight. Make sure think about them old Billy D commercials. Uh, Yo, this shit is straight. Don't I'm, let the bowl taste fool you. And I'm surprised that y'all like it though, because it's it's not a hug on the end. So it's I'm not surprised. really a hug on the end, no, nah, but but it's so it does disappear. It do smell like some fucking uh, somebody just built a motherfucking cabinet in the back. Of shit, yeah, that oh, that sawdust, straight up oak on the nose. Yeah, yeah straight up. It's but then it's got that that maltiness that you get out of a beer, and just a little subtle sweetness that 
This is kind of at the end, almost at the end there. This is some interesting shit. It's different. It's, it's different, different than yeah. anything that I've had in a while. It, it's even different than the Dragon's Milk that we reviewed yeah, a couple years is. ago. What's uh, the uh, what are you here for? <laughs> I don't remember. Oh, it's not expensive. It's, it's more in the forty five range. Okay. Oh shit! If I remember correctly, yeah. Yeah, it's a wrap. Then. Yeah, it's like in forty five yeah. range. Oh yeah, we got to put that. Yeah, a couple bottles. Yeah. 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 <laughs> a couple bottles. Okay. Yeah. All right, I'm fucking around. Okay, I Holly, curious. Michigan. Right. Home of the Flying Dutch. <laughs> <laughs> I did get it at one of the big box stores, so okay. that okay. might be why the price was a little different. A little less, yeah. But um, they they start you off at a 80 proof okay. with the beer barrel bourbon. Then they go to a 101. Um, the one we're having is at the uh, 113. And that is, yeah, I'm really I think liking I, this. I will say this. I think I got to have that, though. I don't think I'm interested in the lower proofs. I don't, I don't think it will go well. Uh, I made a mistake of buying the 80 mm-hmm. and tasting it, and I was pissed. Yeah, that's why I say I don't think I could go down. Cause I, I think I got to be here. Yeah, I got to be here. And the taste on that 80 was not as good as this one. Yeah. You didn't like it's not get, as concentrated. Yeah, you can tell that they basically are using the same mash bill. They're using the same barrels. Mm-hmm. All their taste is consistent. That's okay. the one thing about New Holland that... Their dragon's milk beer is consistent. The bourbon, the the dragon's milk bourbon is consistent. Mm-hmm. This is consistent also. Okay, okay. Uh, you've got the same taste profile all the way through. Yeah, yeah I like I this yeah, yeah, okay. It's a single barrel, so this this bottle may taste different than, than the next. Because yeah. I'm definitely replacing this one for sure. Okay, without a doubt. All right, yeah, folks, with that. Actually, I got our uh, initial findings though, and I, I'm pleasantly surprised to be honest. Uh, but and I think I bought this at Costco. Costco? Oh, oh shit. Okay. I got this and, we, and we can get it at Costco? Yeah. Shit, it's a wrap right. for real. <laughs> On that note, man, we're going to commercial break real quick. But when we return, of course, we got to give our one to five Black Power Fist rating. So you're going to see uh, what we really feel about this new joint that we just tried today. Uh, be back right after the uh, commercial break. You already know what it is. Everybody loves BBW, man. It's beer, it's bourbon, whiskey, the podcast. Be right back. Visit the website right now, www.everybodylovesbbw. That's beers, bourbon, whiskey, the podcast. And we're back. You already know what it is. Everybody loves BBW, man. That's beers, bourbon, whiskey, the podcast. Whole gang is back in the building. Now you get to get that one to five black power fist rating. Uh, I think we started with Bo last week. I can't remember now I because so, it's been yeah. so many weeks. Uh, <laughs> so let's go. Angry principal, man. All blending so many weeks. It, it is. It's all going together, dog. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Especially since we keep wearing the same shirts every fucking week. Slurred but anyway. Speech, everything. Yeah. <laughs> Black jobs. Black jobs. Yeah. Angry principal, what you say, dog? All right, so oh, God. I did. I purposefully. I've had this for a few months, mm. okay, and didn't touch it because I wanted us to review it before I taste. This is my first taste of it. Okay, I'm gonna give it a four. Ooh, this shit. is high. I'm definitely replacing this. Yeah. Um, because it's, it's a little bit more accessible up here. I would definitely go online and, and um, order it if you can. Mm-hmm. But this is one of those that it's gonna be in my bar no matter what. Yeah. So I'm giving it a four. Okay. And the and the water opened it up. I didn't even try the cigar because I'm afraid what it may ruin it. It might ruin it, yeah. it. That water did open it up, so every taste note that I said earlier mm-hmm. was amplified ten times with just two drops of water. So gotcha. I'm <laughs> definitely going with this one. This is a good one, so I'm giving it a four. Yeah, for sure. That's what's up, Bo? What'd you say, bro? Um, it's not on my bar, but it will be soon. <laughs> um, yeah, I I mess with this beer barrel bourbon, right? Uh. I give it a three, so I, or a three and a half. I'm sorry, so, solid three and a half. Uh, price point forty five. That's good. Um, the oakiness, you know, I like it. Like it's nice, strong, oaky bourbon, you know. So like, I mess with that, man. And you got a little bit of that dark beer taste in it too. So yeah, solid three and a half for me. Definitely gonna revisit or uh, get it on my bar. And when that bottle gone, I'm definitely gonna replace it <laughs> <laughs> for sure. Yeah. All right. On that note, I guess I'm gonna round it up. Though. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna give it a three. Um, I think if if the dark beers and, and the the 
the the ales and shit that I tried tasted more like this, I, I might would, would like it. <laughs> I fucking hate those beers and shit. But I will say the combination of that oakiness and kind of that that beer taste in, in between in there, mm -hmm. I think that kind of sets it off. So that's what makes it good. I think the combination of the two is definitely something I would take. Uh, the the beer by itself, I'm just I'm just not a fan. But I'll definitely give it a three, and I would definitely revisit it again. Cause I, to be honest with you, I, I think this is one that w I would probably drink pretty fast. Cause this is kind of like <laughs> this is a little whole ass day at work. So like, let me have a drink, and then <laughs> that one drink turned to three, and then you know how that shit goes. Right. And then you might have company, you had drinks with her and shit, whatever, whatever your case may be. But anyway, I would I would replace that joint though. That's so, okay. um, and then you said the price point was what again? Forty five. Right, right. Yeah, correctly. for sure. Like we yeah. might just buy a couple of those, just have one on deck and shit. I. I would be honest with you to for something because this is completely different from anything else. Like there's no, nothing else I can compare to uh, a bourbon that tastes like motherfucking beer and shit, right? Mm -hmm. So like, this is in a level by itself. So I would say that like this and my ultimate number one go to Evan Williams though I would definitely buy two bottles of each for those and shit because I'm gonna drink most of one of them and then I have to share the other one with company. But uh, yeah, that's it. So I got a three. Uh, you said the uh, four. You said a four and three point five, right? Mm -hmm. All right. So still, I think definitely something that you should give it a shot. Um, beer barrel bourbon, and you said this is uh, from Dragon's Milk. Uh, distillery there we are. New here. Holland. New distillery. Holland Distillery. New yeah. Holland right, distillery. there you go. And there's like one, maybe three black people in Holland, but it's still very, very cool. <laughs> very few it's black a folks very Holland cool Michigan. tasting room though. Yeah. And it's literally 30 minutes from Lake Michigan. Gotcha. So that's the reason we we hit it because we were at Lake Michigan. Yeah. Beautiful out. area, yeah. And uh if you ever get a, a chance to come up and hang in Michigan. Go to Lake Michigan, chill out at one of their public beaches. It's worth it. It You're is absolutely so worth fucking it. beautiful, dog. Yeah, it yeah. is. Yeah, this is it's magical. Make sure y'all go to Sleeping Bear Dunes, too. That's yeah. dope. Yeah. But don't go all the way to the bottom because if yeah. you can't get back up, it's a three thousand three thousand dollars to be 3, rescued. Three thousand? Yeah. Three thousand. Yeah. But they got a sign at the top that says if you go down yep. right. and you can't make it back up, it's gonna cost you this amount. Yep. Shit. So it's it's a and they making a, they making a killer off yeah. that shit too. I yeah. know motherfuckers quitting. I went down. You went down? I got up. Yeah. It took me a while. Yeah. But I got back up there, boy. You're going to have to rest. It's, a, it's an actual doom? It's an actual Bro, sand oh, doom. Fuck. It's an actual sand doom. Hell and it's like yeah. uh, 65 it's degree, 70 so like degree all four. Incline. That's like climbing straight yeah. up. Yeah. It yeah. pretty much. It, it took me like, like an hour. Yeah. But one of the most yeah. spectacular views you can see oh, yeah, anywhere. Absolutely. Yeah. It's, it doesn't compare. Absolutely. Yeah. So absolutely. basically, you're saying just come with the three racks and shit. No. <laughs> just stay your ass at the top. Stay your ass at the top. Yes. <laughs> oh, this is yes. a magical view. Yeah, All right. Indeed. Back to the car. <laughs> hey, and disclaimer I was still in my, I was in my early 30s. Yeah. You know, when, when I did this, I was in the yeah. military. So I was in good shape. Then. Right, right. For sure. Yeah. And you said it still took you hours. It still took me about an hour. I was in my 20s. I looked. I was like, hell no. I'm not doing it. Ain't going to be able to do it. I'm not trying to sweat. Like this, right? Get no. back in this car with his air conditioner, <laughs> right? Shout out to Michigan, though, man. Pure Michigan, pure Michigan. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that note, I guess we are uh, out of here, dog. Again, make sure that you check out the beer barrel bourbon for yourself and see how you like it. Um, again, everybody's palate is different, so uh, check us out the next time. You, until then, though, make sure that you go to the website www.everybodylovesbbw.com. You can actually purchase uh, merch and look at some of the old shows. So make sure you check us out over at the website. Uh, that's it. We're out here. Till the next time. Everybody loves BBW, man. Everybody loves BBW. I want to say it like that. <laughs> this kind of stuff. All right. Anyway, beers, bourbon, whiskey, the podcast. <laughs> We out of here, man. My man, angry principal holding it down. I know I said drink what you like, how you like, but this shit is good. So it is. It actually <laughs> You got to drink this one. So drink what you like, how you like. For sure, man. My man, Bo, holding it down. Hey, buy y'all some merch, man. I got some bills to pay for real. Cardo coming up and insurance, whatnot. Go buy y'all a couple of hats and t-shirts and whatnot. All right? I'll show y'all. You ain't bullshitting. And Ross. <laughs> no. Ross. We about to stay, man. It's your boy Q Lewis holding it down live from the 48205, man. Peace out, y'all.